April 1st has long been circled on plenty of baseball fans' calendars. April Fool's Day is no joke to the fans because it is opening day. And that means a limited number of fans will be allowed back into stands after last year's truncated 60-game regular season was played in empty stadiums because of the COVID-19 pandemic. However, there are plenty of other dates to look forward to on the Major League Baseball schedule in 2021. Here are five, the Los Angeles Dodgers host the Washington Nationals in their home opener at Dodger Stadium. The Dodgers get a chance to raise a World Series championship banner for the seventh time in franchise history but first in 32 years. The Dodgers ended a title drought that extended to 1988 by beating the Tampa Bay Rays in six games last fall. It is a nice touch by the schedule maker to have the Dodgers face the Nationals, who won the World Series in 2019. Washington upset Los Angeles in a National League Division Series that year and the teams have not met since. The St. Louis Cardinals visit the Colorado Rockies at Coors Field. This will be the first trip to Denver for third baseman Nolan Arenado, who was traded by the Rockies to the Cardinals in the offseason. Arenado was a huge fan favorite in Colorado as he won gold gloves in each of his eight seasons and was selected to five All-Star games. Arenado asked to be dealt because of a falling out with general manager Jeff Bridick over the direction of the franchise. The fans are more likely to boo owner Dick Munford and Bridick than Arenado. The All-Star Game at Truist Park in Atlanta. Maybe. One of the casualties of the shortened season was the All-Star Game, in many ways as much a showcase for MLB as the World Series because it is played at a time of year when there is little competition from other sports. The game scheduled for Dodger Stadium was cancelled and Los Angeles will get the opportunity to host the festivities in 2022. This year's game could wind up in another location, though. MLB and the Major League Baseball Players Association have discussed the possibility of moving the game over concerns about legislation adopted in Georgia restricting voting rights. The New York Yankees and Chicago White Sox meet in an 8,000-seat ballpark built in a cornfield in Dyersville, Iowa. The Field of Dreams game will celebrate the 1989 movie of the same name. The park is being constructed adjacent to where the film was shot and includes a glass wall in right field so fans can see the cornstalks. And, yes, the game counts in the standings. The final day of the regular season. All 15 games will begin at 3 p.m. ET and it is MLB's hope that many of them will impact the divisional races and postseason berths. This year's playoffs will be limited to the usual 10 teams after last season's field was expanded to 16 teams on a trial basis.